Hey guys, Iggy back again with Dragon Blogger. So I'm going to turn on the i10X from Tablet Express. Just want to show you how things work. So first off, I'm going to go ahead and put it on the keyboard just for ease of use. And let's go ahead and turn her on. I have not charged it, so I'm assuming there's some battery in there. All right, little light turned on up here. You got the Dragon Touch logo. Again, while this is booting up, this is pretty slick. It's got the mouse right here, left click, right click, and the keyboard. Again, this is the case that is also a keyboard. So that's pretty slick. Yeah, I'm on EST. Central Eastern. All right, and we'll click next. I definitely read all of this. Make sure you guys read it too very important I accept so now we're gonna set everything up we're gonna go for Iggy's can't space it Iggy's tablet next and let's go for my Wi-Fi and there is a security key give me one second all right, we're getting online now. And I never choose Express. We'll do Customize. Yes, Home or Work Networks. Yeah, we'll automatically install them just for now. Automatically get, yeah, we'll do that. Update my apps, sure. Help protect my family. All the defaults are pretty good so far. Use error reporting to check online solutions to problems, sure. Use compatibilities for Internet Explorer, sure. Send some location data to Microsoft, off, perfect. Send Microsoft info, perfect, off. All of this is off. You guys may want it on, totally up to you. I do not want to use Bing for anything. Uh, Internet Explorer, sure. Let apps use my name and account and picture. Sure, I don't do anything wrong on this. Let's apps use my, uh, I don't want advertising ID. Let Windows and app request my location, sure. Get better protection from malware by sending info and files to Microsoft Action Protection Service. We'll put no. All right, it is setting up my account now. And let's go ahead and put some info here. And we'll hit enter. All right. All right, and they sent me a code. All right, verifying my code. All right, system manufacturer Iggy's PC. This seems to be picking up another Windows 8 install. Let's see. Obviously, this is the first time I've turned this on. I don't know anything about it. Heck, I don't even know how charged it is. Alright, so it does a reboot. It's restarting now. Guess to apply some settings. Updates, of course, on the first boot. All right, now going back into Windows, it just reboot. Oh, it looks like uh, Dragon Touch changed the Windows logo. Hi, how you doing? Oh, cool, thanks. I will check. This has some great information. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so it's installing my apps right now. Again, this is the first time 
I've boot into Windows 8 at least on a tablet slash notebook. Kind of excited to see what I get when I get in Windows. Is I've never used Windows for a tablet. I don't know if it's the same kind of Windows. I've read about it. I just I don't know for a fact. So let's see what happens. And God, I hope the battery lasts. Just in case, since I don't know how much battery life it has. Never mind, my cable won't reach right here right now. Taking care of a few things, aka installing apps. So the keyboard itself looks a little tiny, not horribly small. I'm sure this is easy to get used to. Seems pretty nice to me so far. And a little later on, I'm going to do another video showing you how apps, games, and everything works on here. And of course, I'll do the usual benchmarks and all that good stuff. Since this is a full-fledged, essentially, PC, I should be able to get 3D Mark on there or maybe even PC Mark. Who knows? Don't turn off your PC. Be careful. A little bit longer, I'm hoping at least. Getting your apps ready. You're taking a sweet time. And that sound is not the notebook, there's a bird chirping outside. <clears throat> Almost ready, yeah. Feel like I've heard that before. I would assume all the setups are pretty much this low for all uh, tablet Windows 8.1 machines. They can't be slow, the actual usage of them. I would assume they're very fast or else I'm sure no one would buy them. And being that Windows 8.1 is actually, not 8, Windows 8.1 is actually a lot more peppy. 8 was peppy too, but the UI was not many people liked it. I didn't like it myself. Uh, I got used to it, but 8.1 um, is a lot more user friendly. Um, all right. Typically, almost ready means you're almost ready. It's been a few minutes, I think. It would suck if the battery died when it says down here, don't turn it off. And the, the tablet feels very sturdy. I really, really, really love that rubberized back. It, it just makes it feel much more sturdy. Alright, so let's start. Hopefully that's real. Whoa, that's a little bit freaky. 
This was the EVGA mouse I reviewed a while back. It was my background for a time on one of my previous installs of Windows. I guess it kept my personalizations on there from one of my previous... Uh, wow, I'm pretty impressed by that. So we get the full start menu and I forgot this is a tablet so I can swipe. Here is the Microsoft Office that says is free. Um, Alright, so this seems like a full-fledged PC. Wow, this is a PC. So right here Processors, 4 cores, 1.3 gigahertz or 1.33. Sure, there's some turbo in there. The display adapter, Intel HD graphics. It's a it's a it's a tablet, guys. It's not going to have Nvidia or AMD graphics, but pretty nice. It's got. Intel audio, Realtek audio, very, very, very nice. So, and the battery is at eighty six percent. Very nice. I am very impressed so far. Go to this PC. We can see here that 43 out of the 53.1 gigs are free. 64 gig hard drive. Of course, you know you lose a few gigs with the way Windows formats it. And then actually, let's see the real story there. All right, it's got the. 100 meg system partition, that's normal. It's got the 53 gig C uh, partition, and then it's got a 4.88 gig recovery partition. So that's where all your 64 gigs go. F uh, almost five here, add five here, you'd have 58, 100 here. With everything, you might have 59, and then of course, all the memory you lose with Windows, uh, the partitioning, which again, it, that's normal. This is pretty nice. I don't have, again, anything here. This is a brand new install. It looks like it take, took some settings from my previous Windows install, brought them on here. So that is super awesome. But um, anyway, let me let me get to some testing, and I will come back to you guys as soon as possible with some benchmarks, videos, and all that good stuff. Iggy with Dragon Blogger out. See you guys.